Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this turtle. This is a 3D turtle, and you can turn my 3D turtle into Franken the turtle. Looks like this. And today, I'm going to show you how to make this one. For this project, we're going to set our room as a little V here, and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, we're going to make its leg. For the leg, I'm going to use two green. Start it from first to second on your left. Second to third on your left. And for the tip here, I'm going to use brown. I'm going to take one single band, twist, one, two. So you will see three rings here. Place right here, that's cap band. Now we're going to rotate our loom and start looping. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Now you're gonna put your hook here and take it out. And this is one of the leg. We're gonna need total of four of this, four leg. So pause your videos and make three more. So you will have four. I'll see you when you're done. Next, we're going to make the little add on on the back here. This is the add on part that we add to it. For that part, I'm going to take two different colors. Today, I'm going to make this one. So I'm going to take two different brown. But if you want to make different color, you just need to take two different colors. Like this, I use dark green and then lime green. Or this, you can use lime green or neon green. Or you just take any of the two colors to make it really colorful. So today, I'm going to just use two different brown. For the add on, just take two different colors that you're going to use for the back here. Start from first to second on your left. Second to third. And take one of the color here to single band. Twist it one time, only one time. So you create two loops here. Now we're going to rotate our loom and start looping. Hold on to this cap band. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Now we're going to take it off. And this is one of the eight arm piece. Total, we're going to need six of this. So pause your videos and make five more. I'll see you when you're done. Now we're going to start working on its head. For the head and legs, I'm going to use lime green. So I'm going to take two bands. Start from first on the center to first on your left. Two. First on your left to second on the center. Repeat this step and do it on your right. Two, first on the center to first on your right. Two, first on your right to second on the center. Now I'm going to take two bands, twist, one, two. So total, you will see six rings here. Take two bands, twist two times, so you'll create six rings here. Now take two more bands and bring this piece in here. And press right here from first to second on the center. Next, we're going to make its eyes. For the eyes, I'm going to use black, take one single band, twist, one, two, and three. So you create four rings here. Take another single black, twist, one, two, and three. So you create another four rings here. Take one single lime green, the same color that you use for the head. And bring these eyes in here now 
I'm going to place right here from first on your right to first on your left. And I'm going to separate the eyes, keep one eye on each side. Now I'm going to keep this band, pull it, twist it, and make another loop back to the other side. So for this band, it's one single band with two loops on it. And we want to keep the eyes, one on each side. Next, we're going to make its neck. For the neck, I'm going to use three bands from second to third on the center, three, third to fourth on the center, fourth to fifth on the center. Next, I'm going to make its back here. I'm going to take two of different color, any color you like to use. Continue on here from the center to your left. Continue on here on your left, go on this way for three times. Two and three. Last one, gonna go from last one on your left, comes into the center. Now I'm gonna repeat this step and do it on your right. Two, from center to your right. Continue on here on your right, go on this way for three times. Two and three. Going from your right, comes in to the center. Now I'm going to fill in the center part from here to here. Four times. Next, I'm going to press its leg. Take one of the leg, put it back to your hook, press right here. Take another leg, press right here, last one on your left. One more leg. Last one. Now we have four legs on it. Now we're going to press its tail, we're going to make a little tail here, take two, green, continue on here on the center, and take one single band, twist, only one time, so you see two rings here, press right here, from the center, comes out to your left. You can continue on on the center, but the reason why I come back here, the reason why I come out here because it's easy for us to press the cap band on here. Take one single band, twist it, one, two, and three. So you'll create four loops here. Now we're going to press the add on on its back. For the add on that we already made, put the loose end on your hook. Press right here on this peg. Second one from the brown part, one, two. And we're going to take this cap band, press right here on top of this leg. Keep the bands down. Now we're going to take another add on part. Press on the next one. And keep the cap band press on your lap so you will see going this way 
Do one more time, I'm here left. Take another piece. Place on the next one. Pull the cap band. The loose end on the center, the cap band on your left. Now we're going to repeat this step and place another three piece on your right. Take another piece, place the loose end on the center. And grab the cap band, place on your right, on top of the leg here. Take another piece. Put your loose end on your hook. Press loose end on the center. And then grab the cap band. Press on your right. Last one. Put it back to your hook. Press loose end on the center. And grab the cap band, press on your right. So for the, so for the eight arm part, we have six pieces. So going from center to your left for three times. Center to your right for three times. And this is what it should look like. Now we're gonna rotate our loom and start looping. We're gonna start it from here, reach in the cap band, grab the bottom two, hook it to the center. This is where the bands come from, so we hook it back here. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Find the first two, hook it to the next one on the center. This has a lot of band in here. Reach through all the band. Find the bottom two. Grab it. Hook it to the next one. The same. Find the bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Now we're going to come back here. Find the next two. Grab it, hook it to your left, bottom two, hook it to the next one, bottom two, hook it to the next one, bottom two, hook it to the next one. Next, I'm going to look for this two band. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the center here. Now we're going to repeat this step. And grab the bottom two, hook it to your right. Look for bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. And bottom two, hook it to the next one. Now we're gonna continue looping all the band here. Next one has three bands, so make sure you grab all three. Hook it to the next one. Grab all three. Hook it to the next one. All three. Hook it to the next one. Next, find the first two. Grab it. Hook it to the next one on the center. These two bands have come from here, so we're going to hook it back to the center here. Next two should be these two. So just find the next two band. Make sure you take your time to do this part. Because you're almost done, you don't want to mess up on this part. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to the last one on the center. Come back here. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to your right. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the last one on the center here. 
Now after you're done, double check to see if you loop all the band. And when you're done, put gear hook through here. Take one single band, grab it through, put both ends on your hook, take one end to the others, so you will tie a knot here. Now we're going to take it off. On this part, you might want to use your hook to help you pull it out. There's so many pins on the same peg. And this one is double loop it, so it's a little bit high. Now, time to take it up. Now, after you first take it out, it looks like this. But we can fix it, make it look nicer. First, we're going to bring his eyes out, right here. On both sides of the eyes, we want to bring it out so you can see it. You just pull a little bit, it will come out on both sides. So now we have eyes on both sides. Now we're going to hide this secure band. Make sure you secure. Come in the bottom here. Just put your hook through some of the band close by. Put the secure band in here. Grab it through. And if it's still too long, do it one more time. Anywhere is fine. This is just to hide it. Find some band. Grab it through, so you will hide it for us, and you will hold it so you won't pop out. Now we're going to fix the body here. For the body, because we have eight arm bands there, so we need to stretch it a little bit. Just pull a little bit. Then you will create the 3D looking body. Now for this head and the leg, I'm going to pull it. To the side, and pull this little tail. For the head, if you want it, if you want it comes out, so you come here between the brown part and green. You pull this, just pull it out. That way will help you to support this head to stay up like this. And now we have our regular turtle. And if you just want to make the regular turtle, we're done. Just like this. It's a 3D. But if you want to turn him into Franken. Franken the turtle. His tummy is yellow. So we can make a yellow piece. And put in its tummy. So you become Franken. So for this part. For the tummy part. The same. We're going to start with red arrows point away from you. For the tummy, I'm going to use yellow, so take two yellow bands, start from first on the center to first on your left. Two, first to second on your left. Second to third. Two, from third on your left to fourth on the center. Now we're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. First on the center to first on your right. First to second on your right. Second to third. And third on your right to fourth on the center. Take two from first to second on the center. Second to third. Third to fourth. Now we're going to take one single band, twist, one, two. So you will see three rings here. Press right here, let's keep band. Now we're going to rotate our loom and start looping. For this part, 
You don't need horizontal band. Just do like this. Grab the first two. Hold on to your cap band. And then hook it to the next one on the center. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Now come back here. Find the next two. Grab it. Hook it to your left. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the last one on the center. Now come back here. Grab the bottom two. Hook it to your right. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the next one. Bottom two. Hook it to the last one on the center. Hook your hook through here. Take one single band, grab it through. Put both ends on your hook. Take one end to the others. And tie your knot here. Now it's time to take it off. Now after you take it off, you can hide this secure band. The same, put your hook through some of the band cross by. Take one end through the others. Pull it through, tuck it underneath. So now you create the tummy part here. Now we're going to take our turtle and just tuck this piece inside the tummy here. Just tuck it in. You will hold it for us. Like this. So now we have his yellow tummy. And if you want to make a red decoration here for this ball, I'm going to take three red pen, press in between two pegs, anywhere is fine. And take one single band. Grab it on the bottom part. Through. We're just going to tie a knot here. So you put both ends on your hook. In between these three bands. Like this. And now we're going to take one end through the others and pull it like this. This is a holding band to hold in all these three bands. You can take it out. So now we have a little ball here. We have three bands here. We're going to take a scissor and cut one of the bands. Just one. And after you cut it, you wanna hold one of the one end and pull this the other end to the other side. So this is the band that we cut. Now, now I'm gonna take this holding band and drop it along on its neck. Take this loop, the holding band, holding the ball, spin it through the head, like this. You can do just like that, or you can drop it one more time so you'll make it tighter. Now for the ball, for this part, it's a little bit too long, so I'm gonna trim it a little bit. So this long part, I'm going to trim it shorter, just cut it off, so that way it won't be too long, and center it. And here's a little ball on his neck, and this will look like a Franken the turtles. If you like this video, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you for watching, see you next time.